So, my mission was to buy a VW Transporter T5 and convert it into a camper van. I came across this 2009 Sportline which was for sale in a local salvage auction and thought it would be a suitable candidate for this project as I not only wanted a camper but I also wanted something that would look good and turn a few heads once it was finished and the colour was perfect for what I had in mind. Now the reason I decided to purchase a damaged vehicle was because I'm fortunate enough to own my own body shop so the repairs would not be costing anything other than the parts. The pre-accident condition of the vehicle was very good and had only covered 83,000 miles. The damage sustained was to the offside front wing, bumper, headlight and door. So the next step was to remove the damaged parts. It turned out that there was also suspension damage, this being the lower wishbone which I had to replace immediately as the wheel was rubbing up against the body making the vehicle undrivable. Once the new wishbone had been fitted you could clearly see that the wheel had moved forward clearing the bodywork, however it was obvious that something still wasn't right, the gap between the wheel and the arch was not the same as the other side so upon more investigations the culprit turned out to be a damaged subframe. I managed to source a second hand subframe locally and had it fitted within an hour. Now that all the suspension and steering was perfect it was time to start putting it all back together again. As most of the front needed replacing I decided to give it a facelift which is very easy to do on these T5s. I managed to save the lower front spoiler, which I then went on to fit to the new bumper. So with the new wing and bumper fitted, she's really beginning to take shape. The next job was to spray the bonnet and the wing. Here we see it with the new bonnet and headlights fitted. The headlights bolt straight on, however the wiring is slightly different to the pre-facelift headlights. So you would either need to rearrange the wiring at the connector or you can purchase pre-wired connectors which fit your original wiring glue and go straight into the back of your headlights. These can be purchased off eBay. I just rewired mine. Next it was the bumper's turn to get a lick of paint. I decided to spray the mirrors and front grille gloss black. To finish it off I fitted a gloss black VW badge, a red strip in the lower grille and a little German badge in the upper grille. The headlights were also tinted with a special film to give it a more aggressive look. So all in all the repair took me about 10 days to go from this to this. 
Other than the subframe, it was quite a straightforward repair and I enjoyed every minute of it. Now that's done, I can concentrate on the next step which is actually converting it into a camper van. I will do this in several stages and share my experiences with you, so keep watching for the next episode.